Hi, this is Ron Zuckerman. I'd like to give you a tour of my latest purchase. I bought this at the Southern Appalachian Dulcimer Festival 2016. It is made by John Harris of Sweet Strings. And not really sure what to call it. Um, I've heard some people call it a dulcimet. Uh, I've heard octave dulcimer. I've also heard soprano dulcimer. So take your pick. So it has a simple rectangular shaped body. It has eight small circular sound holes. Uh, the top's made of poplar. The fretboard and headstock are made of Osage orange. It is tuned to D, D, A, D. It's an octave above a standard dulcimer. Um, has post for the strings. You can accept um, ball end or loop end strings. Um, this happens to have both of them right now. Um, the tuning pegs are zither pins. Um, just like you'd find on a regular bowed psaltery. I use this T-wrench to tune them. The dimensions are about 18 and a quarter inches long. About five inches wide. And the thickness is about one and a half inches. Uh, the sides are also orange osage. Or osage orange, rather. The back is also poplar. Has this interesting knot. Gives it some character. Has a zero fret six and a half fret, that's the only half fret it has, and it goes all the way up to 11. Um, the vibrating string length is 16 inches. So the range is from the D above middle C, all the way up to this really high A, which is two and a half octaves. Let me give you a demo of the sound has a kind of mandolin-like sound to it. Great cat on a Tennessee farm.